What do you think about the how the UFC is continuing to have cards going on with this whole pandemic? You know, as as a fan, I like watching it. You know, I mean, I'm a huge yeah. UFC fan. Um, but what do you think as a, as somebody that's in the game? You know, how, how do you feel about that? You know, again, it goes back to unions and stuff. We don't have anybody to kind of stand up for us. I'm not saying it's wrong. They have to make money, and it's not because he's trying to help everybody to work. He's he's trying to help the people that 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 are in charge of the company. Mm -hmm. But in but he is helping you know, a lot of people keep busy to make paychecks, you know, and to keep going. Uh, so it's a double-edged sword. You know, I feel like if they're taking all the precautions, um, it's not bad. But, um, you know, it's not because he wants to help people or yeah. help fighters. And you know? you're right. The double-edged sword's so. a great analogy. Um, you know, we saw Jacare at the event at Wands just, you know, oh, yeah, you have the, you know, coronavirus. And then yeah. I was listening to Aljamain Sterling speak, and he was his girlfriend, I think, um, had it. And she was pretty sick, you know, and, and whatnot. And he was like, well, if they would have offered me the title fight, I, I had to take it just because, you know, it was quadruple yeah. my pay as normal. And just, again, to go back to that pay, man, like that sucks that you're going like, listen. I'm probably, probably going to be okay if I contract this, you know, virus, but yeah. I might not be, but listen, man, I'm running out of money. That's yeah. tough, bro. Yeah. You know, it is tough. And, and, uh, I don't know what's going on with all the other pro sports, but, um, you know, it's, it's, it's probably where, um, they're having like people talk on, the behalf of the players, you know, and kind of negotiating how this needs to work. But um, it's not like that. It's, it's just like, Hey, this is going to happen. And, and whoever wants to take this, you know, can take it, you know, we're going to throw a little bit of money at you. And, and, you know, there's, there's not a lot of guys who can hold out, you know, like there's not a, there could never really be a strike in MMA because I mean, who can, who can really hold out, you know? Yeah. Like your top 1%, maybe like, you know, you're maybe your, your McGregor, you know, who's yeah. making money some other different ways too. But how, how many Conor McGregor's are there? You know, there's one. Yeah. So. Whereas like, you know, this NFL, they strike and uh, you know, everybody could do it. Sure. Thank you.